Hi YouTube. I was with my son the other day. We were actually at Toys R Us and uh, we had to buy a birthday present for a friend of his. Uh, he was going to a birthday party. And I was kind of playing a game with myself as I was in the store. I was saying, what in here costs more than an ounce of silver? Okay. And as I was looking around, my, I was kind of surprised at how basically, how, how much of this stuff, all of this plastic stuff made in China, um, all this plush stuff made in China and, and with no value whatsoever, all stuff destined for a landfill and how much of it costs more than an ounce of silver. So I was like, you know what, it's time to take a common sense approach here. You know, before you put your money into anything, of course there's risk, okay? Any investment carries a, a degree of risk with it, okay? Um, but when you think about what goes into mining this metal, what goes into processing it so that it's an investable form, and then what goes into actually producing the silver coins. This is a year of the horse round that's being sold for $20.69. So why don't we take a look here and see what in fact does cost more than silver. First of all, tell these guys that silver doesn't have value, the conquistadors, that basically sold, or sold, sailed halfway around the world to lands unknown, wiping out ancient civilizations for silver and gold. Tell them it, it wasn't worth uh, pursuing. Tell these guys that silver doesn't have value spending their lives on the seas looking in search for silver and gold. Of course, they uh, usually stole it. Tell these guys that silver doesn't have any value, as they basically wrote into the Constitution that silver is money. All ancient history, right? Tell this guy that uh, silver doesn't have any value. Basically, any Apple product that you buy, any technology product that you buy today will have some silver in it. If you want your technology to perform at an optimal level, you got to use silver. Its unique properties mandate that you get top performance. And as technology gets more and more complex, the need for silver grows. Tell these guys that silver doesn't have value. As the earth goes to green energy, silver will play a role there as well. Okay, we know all this. This is what we talk about all the time. Okay, but let's, let's see what, 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 what is uh, more expensive than silver. How about a Justin Bieber backstage doll set for $32.99, guys? Hookers and blow sold separately. For an ounce and a half of silver, you can have this doll. Now, what, where would you rather put your money? A Justin Bieber backstage doll set or an ounce, of, ounce and a half of silver? I'm not done. I should stop the video right here. That, that, that says it all. Okay. So, you know, you're used to seeing all these other ratios. Maybe we should now have the Justin Bieber doll to silver ratio. That, that's got to that's gotta collapse at some point. How about the I'm with stupid t-shirt? $27.95. The I'm a stupid t-shirt for when you're hanging out with your Keynesian friends. Oh, come on. $28, guys. Okay? I'm not done. Bat guano. Bat poop, guys. The ultimate renewable resource. As long as there are bugs and as long as there are bats, there will be bat poop. And they're selling it for $33.48 for an 11-pound bag of it. Okay? So you don't like zombies on your silver rounds. Well, here we have a zombie figure made of 100% resin for $25, more than an ounce of silver, for this thing that was basically pumped out of a factory, poured into a mold, pumped out of a factory. The Breaking Bad Lego set. Okay, so when you want to basically have a, a Lego set where you can create toy drugs, $250 for this thing, okay? 12 ounces of silver for a Breaking Bad Lego set. And last but certainly not least, the iPoddy. A plastic toilet for your kid. If you want to get them addicted to screens early on while they're going pee, they can play with their iPad for two ounces of silver. Look. It's really funny because if you were basically hanging out in your I'm a stupid t-shirt, putting together your Breaking Bad Lego set with a bag of bat poop by your side, nobody would think twice about it. You decide to put your money into this metal and suddenly you're buying a one-way ticket to crazy town. Okay? 
let's just take a common sense approach here. Our financial system is dependent on perpetual growth. The problem is we live in a finite world. Okay, and whenever perpetual and finite get into that steel cage match, my money's on finite every time. Okay, so that is why I'm more than happy to be paying for uh, $19 an ounce for silver here. Okay, but do your own diligence. This is just the way that I see it. Okay, guys, talk to you later.